Item number SCP-6692 Optic Class Keta Update Thaumio Security Level 2 Special Containment Procedures Research and investigation into SCP-6692 manifestations are ongoing. Verbal or written orders that contain terms such as missile and small arms are to be resented and altered to prevent potential collateral damage to Foundation operations. Description SCP-6692 is a series of semantic manifestations occurring throughout Site-81 and Site-118, which predominantly affect words pertaining to weaponry, rendering them ineffective when commanded either verbally or through written documentation. The anomaly itself has been observed in 73% of all instances relating to terms affected by SCP-6692, causing considerable damage to Foundation property and personnel, and thus prompting further containment protocols. It is believed that a malicious Foundation thaumaturge is responsible for this phenomenon, although their whereabouts have yet to be ascertained. Addendum 1. Affected Nomenclature The following words have been discovered to be affected by SCP-6692 and recommended changes to be made when these words are not in use. Affected Word Missile Recommended Change Armed Projectile or a Head Tile Accidentally discovered following decommissioning efforts of an anomaly when Captain Andy Wagner of the SCPS Voyager commanded his team to deploy armed projectiles against the target. When these armed projectiles inadvertently diverted off course, Captain Wagner jokingly requested that the crew use head tiles against the target. The subsequent deployment of head tiles precisely impacted the anomaly. Harpoon Bob Spear while attempting to use the equipment on the Icelander travesty ship, Foundation personnel reported that all available barb spears were replaced with brass objects that emanated a pleasant sound, according to eyewitnesses. Foundation personnel would later scrap these objects for their material, selling it to advance funding for underdeveloped sites. Boomerang Throne 2 referred to anomalous event 6691-1. Heavy weapons. Crew served weapons. Site 118's crew served weapons became impossible to operate due to their increased weight. Small arms. Portable guns. Ordered by MTF Epsilon 35. Ball busters. Squadron leader Andy Charles. MTF agents reported a drastic alteration to their arms and body, with measurements reporting that the arm span of all MTF Epsilon 35 members have shrunk over 40%. X-ray scanning indicated that the muscular and bone structure of these MTF members had strengthened immensely. This process is currently being used as a physical enhancement for MTF members. Assault! Aggravated Attack! During an aggravated attack amongst researcher Devin Collins and Daniel Ashenworth, researcher Collins was suddenly stripped of all clothing and displaced with a single grain of salt recovered from his home. This would later be used as an emergency escape method for untrained personnel. Bullet! Ammunition! Foundation personnel utilizing portable guns during this time were ineffective at harming enemy combatants. All stray rounds would later impact a nearby cattle farm, in which a single bow was reported as the sole casualty. Firearms Guns or Weapons Foundation Weapon Specialist J.A. Lee Ted's arms were officially posted to the master list of employees and subsequently removed. Standard surveillance pay was administered to both arms for the service. Bazooka 
Rocket Launcher. While well, attempting to use the rocket launcher, MTF agents were unable to fire projectiles from the weapon. Instead, large beehives were ejected. Of note was the considerable buzzing sound that emanated from the weapons themselves. Foundation personnel would later find this effective as a sabotage method, allowing enemy combatants to take defective rocket launchers in order to use against the Foundation. Light Weapons Land Portable System During a requisition request by MTF Moon 9, Mission Possible for backup as they only had man portable systems. The density of all Foundation supplied weapons to the MTF immediately decreased despite their mass and floated into the atmosphere. The weapons have not been recovered. Mission Hin Foundation databases reported a 96% increase of successful MTF deployments following the introduction of the newly suggested word.